Hi guys, so I'm here at Dr. Nurina Wilkinson Skin Clinic and Dr. Tracy will be helping me do some exciting procedures. Well, not helping me, she will be doing <laughs> all of it. So basically, we're going to be doing fillers on the skin or in the skin. We're going to be doing a little bit of Botox and also I'm finally going to be doing lip fillers after debating about it for I think almost a year and a half or two years. So I'm going to be taking guys along on this journey to show you guys um, exactly what's happening. I'm actually not nervous at all. I'm pretty excited. So I've taken off all the makeup on my skin. I do have my mascara on, but um, yeah, pretty excited. You decide to do your jawline. Was it to give you a bit of a lift? A little bit of yeah, lift. Yeah, to take away that sort of roundness mm. from the front. Do these hurt? Um, a little bit, but it's not not badly. Mm. Are you ready? I am, I'm very nervous around needles, so kind of. Yeah, I'll try and hide <laughs> them away from you. Okay. I'm going to close my eyes while we're filming. So. Yeah. I can see that the corner of your eye on the yeah. outside is lifted. So there, you're slightly lifted yeah. up there. Do you see that? I feel more awake on the side. Your, eyebrow, your eyebrows definitely <gasps> oh, lifted. I and then do a smile for me. Like a, like a big smile. Can you see your smile is yeah. higher on that side? Oh, your mouth actually gosh. pulling sideways like that. I love this. <laughs> oh, I love this so much. <gasps> Already made Already. a difference to your jawline mm. as well because you don't look so. Um, no, no, it's okay. Can you, you see that? And you, you actually don't look as. Yeah, you look more square still. Yes. Do you see that? It's Whereas, a bit more, yeah, you've got yes. a bit of an angle, and we haven't yet done this for you. Do you know how much I've always wanted to like just have this little, like, little bit lifted? A little bit of definitely. Oh, let's do the next step. Cool. Get used to this. Felt it like here yeah. lifting yeah oh my gosh <gasps> am I seeing is it is it real the, is it the jaw angle yeah. yeah oh my gosh okay yeah for sure so let's just take this off because it mm. might affect it you can 100 yeah, see it does give you a sharper angle because mm. you can see the two difference yeah you don't look you don't look heavy at all now look mm. nice and straight you look there going up so but the best thing for me is your smile because when you smile everything just lifts it lifts high on this side. Oh. Okay. Now I still feel like myself. Um, just more lifted. I think we've just softened your chin a bit. Your chin mm. tends to look quite square. Otherwise, or quite wide. So yes. I've just kind of rounded it a okay. little bit. Mm. It's quite a subtle. Mm. I don't think change. I'd want more. Right I think now. it's nice. Mm. I think it's nice. Okay. And nice. how long does this last? About 18 months. 18 so. months? Yeah. Okay, wow. 12 to 18. Okay. The, the, what we did at the back of the jawline can last up to two years. Yeah. Wow. It's lips about a year. Okay. Okay, so just tell me with your lips. Do mm. you want volumization at the top and the bottom? Both. Both. A little, not as much at the yes, bottom, but it does hide. Like when I do this, when you smile. Okay. and it instantly, like, no, yes. like smile, it rolls in. It rolls in. Okay. So when I'm smiling, when I'm filming and stuff, I don't want it to kind of hide. It feels okay. fine. Yeah, okay. this falls a bit of the prick, but. I think I'm very dramatic uh, with my facial expressions, <laughs> okay. so just ex ex ignore okay, them a little okay. bit. Yeah, I'm fine. Um, okay. It was just a shock, initial shock. Yeah. yeah. Do 
you and I have a little bit before I carry on and just tell me because I mean I really put a little bit of volume in there but it is more volumized. Let me give you a mirror. Yeah. I like this. It's better when you smile. Mm. Huh? So much nicer. Ah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna do the same on the other side mm -hmm. and then we'll do something on your lower level. Okay. The filler also does is it, it kind of like moisturizes your lip. I need that. So it, your lips are not so dry and it just makes that also makes them look a bit plumper. The, the side that's got the more volume in it so maybe yes. I, I might just need to add a little bit on this side mm, i think it's just here on the top yeah what do you think yes yeah, so but I it could see, just I be can see exactly what you see mm. oh, for me it's like a big song <laughs> it looks good okay and relax i'm just gonna put the last little bit in the bottom lip just to see because Wait, i got it yeah. as well i know that's all you I'm so happy with Okay, so it's been about an hour. They're swollen, but not as swollen as I thought they would be. And um, my face feels fine. I can just feel it by my jaws over here. But the fillers will only really show a difference in about a month. And the baby Botox will show a difference in about a week. And my lips will be calmed down in about two days. Maybe even less. Um, I'm so happy. But I can't exercise until Saturday. Today is Wednesday, so for another two days. But overall, the experience has been pleasantly... What is the word? It has been good. It has been good. Can I ask you how you feel about it? I can't ask you how you feel about it. Hi guys, uh, it is the next day. It's been exactly about 24 hours. I think 24, 25 hours. And this is what my lips look like. I just put a lip balm on it. I had to use a brand new product. I didn't, they don't want um, any pre-used products on your lips for the first two days. And you can go back to using whatever you're using, but just for the first two days, they recommend using fresh products. So I opened the Silk Balm from Huda Beauty and I have it on my lips. And I just did a bit of concealer touch-ups and then eyebrows because we're just gonna be running so many errands today. This is what my lips look like. I'm happy, honestly. Like if the swelling goes, I don't want I actually don't want it to be like you know smaller like I actually won't mind my lips looking as plump as they do right now um, I'm happy with it I'm happy with the size uh, if it goes smaller then maybe I would want to go for a few more mils not a few more mils but a little bit more plump lips um, but so far I'm like loving it I don't know if the swelling is going to go down anymore but I'm so happy so far at least four weeks for the face fillers to really show its full effect so i'm pretty excited to see how everything works and my my did the baby botox here you can already see it's working yeah i'll keep you guys updated on what's happening and how it looks but i'm pretty happy so far my last check-in for this video it's been about two weeks since i had my lips face and botox done i just finished a campaign but i had like a lot of hearts and red makeup on my face so i just took it off my cheek right now and i just reapplied a softer lipstick just because the, my lips were stained with red i haven't overlined my lips as you can see they are much fuller oh the lights getting really bright much fuller but still natural when i smile my lips don't hide like look you can still see my lips like super full i love it i feel like this is gonna take some more time to really show a difference but the botox let me just take away from the lights you can see anything botox you can really see it worked love it I'm so happy that I went ahead and you know chose to do all of this because I'm so happy with the results so far. Um, I would always be wondering like, should I do it? Shouldn't I do it? The lips are supposed to last a year, and the fillers and Botox are supposed to last even longer than that. And honestly, I would, I would go back. I'd definitely go back. I'm so happy. Thank you so much to Dr. Marina, his whole team. Dr. Tracy was amazing. I'm so happy with the results. Okay, bye.